Hello everybody, how are you doing? So welcome to the next in the series. So this video is about developing a settlement or an installation depends on the mode of the project uh, using the Voronoi 3D component. So let's get on to the video. The first step is to get a rectangular base and do the extrusion to develop a form in which the 3D component can come. And uh, the, to get the 3D component, you need to use 3D populate tool in which it will randomly distribute the points all over the form. In this case, it's a cuboid, so it will randomly distribute all the points in the cuboid. And uh, you want, if you want another iteration of this, you can use a seed component which will in every iteration it gives a different result so you can try that out So the next step is to use dispatch component and eliminate them and eliminate the ones that you don't require. For example, I just need 50% of this so I can use a seat, I can use a dispatch component and a boolean logic to remove it out. So the boolean logic that can be used over here is uh, larger than in which you can give the distances and you can eliminate the distances that you don't want using a larger than component which is very basic.
The third step is to randomly separate the list. As per design, I have done it in two sets. The proportions can be as per the seed and division values where your percentage of division can be ranging from 0.5% to 0.8% to 0.9% however you want as your design to look like. And if you want to color it, you can do it using a custom preview. Right now I'm not shown here, but there's an option where you can show the colors to different baked components. And so the last step is to pipe these edges by using deconstruct B-Rep and just piping it out with the edge, all the edges to give a defined form of yours. And so this is how it, the model turns out to be. As per my design, I have removed a surface from every Vernois cell as an opening to the tent or this enclosed space, so which will justify the room for movement and that's how this design turns out to be. So if you liked it, please like and subscribe and I appreciate all the acknowledgement. And thank you and have a nice day. Bye.